So what is the pastor's take on the prosperity gospel? Let's listen to what he has to say. It is prosperity, but it's not prosperity that has morphed into yeah. a neo-prosperity gospel. It's a self-help gospel that is, it is neo-prosperity that wraps itself around the guys. Watch this. Can we be honest? Mm -hmm. Around your purpose, yep. your desire, mm -hmm. your will, what you want to do, your vision board, and all of the preaching is to facilitate what you, you want to do. That is a new version of the prosperity gospel yeah. that I think is more dangerous because it's it's cancerous and mm -hmm. it's undetected. So it sits just under the surface of our senses yeah. and we sit back in these churches and we eat that up. And so we leave these churches thinking about my own personal will and agenda and how I can twist God's arm to support that yep. we're not leaving these churches feeling convicted over yep. our sin yep. feeling like how am i being a better steward mm -hmm. how am i ringing out the sin of my own heart mm -hmm. how am i serving god what is god's mission and how does my life flow into that yeah. mission if my life along with your life are just tributaries how are these tributaries men women mm -hmm. flowing into the river of the great commission and what god has called us to do but no that's not our preaching is not preparing us yep. for that. Yep. It's not preparing us to suffer well. It's not preparing us to sacrifice. It's not preparing us, can I go deeper? Yep. For eternity. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm gonna say something right here, okay? Right here on In Totality. I'm telling y'all right now, there are some dangerous times coming for America. Mm -hmm. Let's read from Matthew 28, starting at verse 18. The Great Commission. And Jesus came and spoke to them saying, all authority has been given to me in heaven and on earth. Go therefore and make disciples of all the nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, teaching them to observe all things that I have commanded you. And lo, I am with you always, even to the end of the age. Amen. I encourage you, subscribe, share, and like for more Christian-based content. Take care and God bless.